Bonjour, guten Tag. What's up, bruv? Guys, what a beautiful day where there's no time to waste. Today, I have training and it's my first training for this pro club. Finally, after such a long time, I'm going to have the opportunity to train with them and hopefully the manager likes me and he's going to give me that contract. But I fight it so long for that. So no much talking i'm gonna have breakfast because training starts at 10 30 and it's now 8 30 so i'm gonna have breakfast and then head to the training grounds and man i'm ready i'm ready and even that my groin is not 100 percent fit but man i think it, it should be fine like because i did some sprints and it was all right so man when you have this kind of opportunity, man, you don't let anything dis distract you. This injury or something, no, man, I, it needs to work, groin, please. But man, let's do it. Man, back from training, everything was good. Manager came, wow, you're tall, man. We can need someone like you. Everything fine. Training starts, we do the warm up, everything fine. 10 minutes into a small, simple passing drill, and someone gives me a bad pass, and I do a big step. And I felt my groin, ah, I felt it. So I had to stop, I had to stop. So I saw the physiotherapist and he said, yeah, it's probably a strain. Was you injured before? I said, yeah, I had like, yeah, it was a bit tight, but yeah, he said, yeah, you probably strained your groin and you just need to rest and put ice on it. So that's why I'm icing it now. But why, why? This was the biggest opportunity I had, the biggest opportunity so close from a pro contract, so close. And this injury, this groin, why, why? And normally I didn't want to do even a video because this is so hard. Seriously, this is so hard. I was so close. So close. And tomorrow there's a match. Tomorrow we're gonna play a match. And the physiotherapist said, I try to put ice on it every hour and to see tomorrow morning how it goes. So maybe I'm going to play, but... Man, why? Why does this happen to me? Seriously, why does this happen to me? I 
fight it so long for this opportunity and this happens. <sighs> but you know what? Giving up is not an option. I will keep doing. I will keep doing. So I will try to ice it and maybe a wonder will happen and tomorrow I'm gonna play but then it's hard. I was so close, so close. And those players are. <sighs> when I'm feeling you, I'm just like a whip Oh my days, what a beautiful place. Look at this man. This is one of the most beautiful views I've ever viewed. <laughs> wow. And even that I'm injured now. Oh, what means injured? Like, I can walk. Like, it's nothing serious. I think just I started a bit too early because of my groin strain. But those moments like this just reminds me that Brendan is not just all about football. Man, and even that I'm so close to that pro contract and I don't know what will happen. Maybe I can play tomorrow or not. I don't know. But I don't think so, to be honest, because it's no sense to to play to force me to play and then it gets worse so man but this view Take a chance and blow it like the ref But you can see my vision, girl, I'm different than a rest You're the only one that knows the thing that beats inside my chest And I'm not just staying here so I can fix whatever's left Look, step inside my line, she's so divine with how I picture you When you come to mind, you come alive and make the image move You're stuck inside my head, you get ahead and make the feelings bloom I Man, I'm in the middle of nowhere Eating my bread With avocado and it just feels so good to just relax and I don't know if it's bad luck or it's meant to be and you guys can't imagine how I feel all I want is just cry and and leave everything behind me and just and just hide behind I don't know something and sometimes I I just think, man, it's a dream. Please, I need to wake up. But in a bad way. The best advice that I can give to you, if you ever want to do this journey as well, you will face loads of tears, disappointment, but the key is just keep doing. And even now, again, I'm injured. Like, not injured, but... My groin strain came out again, but I will just keep doing it. And if this opportunity doesn't work, another will come. Trust me. Only got the time to dwell in time, so when I'm missing you, then love it when you come around, hate it when you leave. You get me out my head and move my soul throughout yeah. the breeze. I don't mean to sound cliche, but I'm just saying what I mean. I'm about to do a song so you can hear this what I think. <laughs>
man when you're all the way down there <clears throat> and you have to go up again man this is hot but man let's go back to the hotel Whew. back in the hotel and tomorrow is the game I put literally every hour for at least 10 minutes ice I bought Votorol that I used as well and it will help this inflammatory this inflammation to to calm down and am I ready for tomorrow's game right now I would say no because man it hurts still but I don't know what's going to be tomorrow Maybe I'm risking my whole career because maybe if I play and it's getting worse, man, I don't want to think of that. But man, I want to play because if I play good, like at least a half and I score a goal or something, man, I'm sure they're going to sign me. And then finally, finally, I'm going to get that pro contract. But for that, I need to play. So I took, I think, ibuprofen, paracetamol tablets to just be able to play. Man, I know miracles are true and they can happen. And hopefully, it's going to be a miracle. So that's I'm going to have an early night's sleep. And <sighs> please, please somehow i need to play but we don't know i don't know and i did some stretches and stretches are not so painful it's all right but football is man it's different if you do those sharp movements quick change of direction and if i'm gonna play those players and managers they don't gonna consider my injury they're just gonna judge me on what they see so, man, I need to know what I'm going to do. But if you have that pro contract so close in front of your nose, I think everyone in my situation would do the same and at least try to play. But we will see. But thanks again for the support. And my friend Kelvin, who was with me at the UK football trials, just signed a pro contract at Cheltenham Town. This is crazy man congrats i know you're watching and felicitations but it's a proof hard work pays off so i hope you guys enjoyed watching today's video make sure you subscribe if you haven't already smash that like button guys and keep in mind when you believe everything is possible so team randall mm, i'll see you tomorrow <laughs>